Hey there, Louis Acabellis here. Thanks for stopping by. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you one of my favorite tricks in Microsoft Teams, and that's how to save channel posts and chat messages. Now, before we get started, if you find this tutorial helpful, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest Microsoft Teams tutorials that I publish. Now let's go ahead and let's get started. Now, what exactly does it mean to save a message? Well, saving messages in Teams essentially allows you to bookmark them so that you can actually come back to them later or so that you can easily access them when you need to. Now, how I use saving messages in Microsoft Teams is I actually use this to bookmark important messages either that I've read and I need to action later or that I just need to keep that message handy because it's pointing me to some other resource. Now let's go ahead and let's look at how to actually save messages and how to access them in Microsoft Teams. All right, now you can actually save both chat messages and channel posts. Now I'll start off by showing you how to save a chat message and you'll see that the process is exactly the same as when saving channel posts. Now you can see here that my colleague Adele has sent me a message in a chat that I have with her. Now to save this, what you want to do is you want to hover over it. And when you hover your cursor over the message, you're going to see these emojis pop up. And at the end of this expanded menu is a three dot icon, which is more options. When you click on this, you're actually going to see a sub menu. And you can see here this option that says save this message. Now that will actually save the message and to access your saved messages, what you want to do is you want to scroll up to the top of your team's application and you want to click on your profile icon. And what you're going to see here is this option that says saved. If you click on this, this is where you can actually come to view all of the different messages that have been saved. And so you can see here, there is a menu on the left. And right now I just have this one chat message that is saved. And you can see here that it displays in this menu. So again, it's just a quick way for you to bookmark messages so that you can either view them later or action them later. Now what I'll do is I will quickly show you how to save a channel post. And so in my activity feed, I was tagged in a channel post in one of the teams that I'm a member of. Now you can see here this channel post that I was tagged in. Now to save channel post, it's the exact same process. So you want to place your cursor on top of the channel post and you want to click on the three dots, the more options button. And in this sub menu, you want to go ahead and click on save this message and it is going to go ahead and save the message. And again, to actually access your saved messages, you want to click on your profile icon and you want to click on the saved option. And again, you can see here, it's now added this channel post and I also have that chat message. Now, if you actually want to remove a message from your saved list, all you need to do is click on the little bookmark icon and you can see when I hover over it, it says unsave this message. And if I go ahead and click on that, it's going to remove it from my saved messages list. So again, this is a really handy trick to help you bookmark messages that you either want to review later or to save messages that contain resources that you might need to access at a later time. So that's it. This was just a quick video showing you one of my favorite Microsoft Teams tips, and that's how to save both chat messages and channel posts. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest Microsoft Teams tutorials that I publish. I'm Louis Acabellis. Thanks for stopping by. Talk soon.